Hypothetical situation. Let's say you're driving for Uber and I get in your car and I steal your car. He's stealing my car! But I get into an accident. Who's at fault? Who is liable for the car accident? Is it you? Is it me? Or is it Uber? Or is it James River Insurance? Welcome back to InsureTech Walk and Chips. I'm your host, Kevin, and this is episode number four. Back to you at the office, Kevin. And we're back to the office. The ubiquity and recent distribution of technology has allowed insurance companies to better connect with millennials. An example is Nexar, part of our previous batch. Nexar accesses the camera sensors on your phone and detects in real time the accidents that have occurred on the road. It leverages the network effects as well as all of the combined technologies that millennials are holding in their hands so it can alert you in real time who is at fault and when. Nexar just graduated from our last batch and pitched at Expo. Please take a look. We have built the first vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle network that we've jump-started utilizing the existing cellular network and the power of smartphones in everyone's pocket. Let me tell you a secret. No, closer. Our roads are actually getting safer. They're getting smarter. Not because of new technologies that have been implemented, no thank you Highway 101, but because of the same sensors in our phone. Uber has partnered with Sentience, part of our last batch, to access contextually aware data, streaming from your phone on how hard you're braking, how quickly you're accelerating, and that data ultimately goes into pricing gap coverage for Uber drivers. Now tell me how fascinating that is. I'm super jazzed. In the past month alone, we've had over 100 startups introduced to corporations in our immediate network, and over 200 office hours conducted via these meetings. I am jazzed up again. Thanks for joining me on the fourth episode of InsureTech Guac and Chips. And Kevin, I where's my car? Back to the car. And don't go around stealing Ubers because that would be unwise.